Now that your business hours are configured, let's review how to set up an analytics report to capture key metrics for your team. Follow along in your front analytics as we check this out. First, create views for your support team analytics. You can create and pin multiple views here with your pre-selected filters to reference at any time. Click Add View to create a new view and apply filters such as inboxes, teammates, tags, and more. As you can see, I've already created, saved, and pinned a custom view here for my support team. You may want to create a view for each support inbox or group of teammates, and you can customize that here using the filters. Once you select your filters and you've chosen the correct date range here, use the overview report to see a general summary of what's happening in your workspace. You can click the gear icon here to customize which metrics are pinned to this main metrics overview section. Let's see what metrics are helpful to support teams here. If you're used to a ticket-based view of your data, the conversation metrics section will be a great place to start. Active conversations will show you how many conversations were active during that time period, meaning any activity occurred on the conversation. New conversations will show you how many brand new conversations were started during that time period. Compare the two to see how many existing conversations carried over into the time period that you're looking at versus how many new conversations were started during that period. Note the indication of increase or decrease here below the metrics numbers. This is showing the change compared to the previous time period of equal value. So if you're viewing this week's metrics, then the increase or decrease will be in comparison to the last week. If you're viewing this month's, you'll see the comparison to last month's. The changes over time table will show you various data throughout the time period that you've selected. You can choose different metrics here in the dropdown to see how things change throughout the duration of the period for that specific metric. Below this, we have a high level view of reply data, workspace specific data, and top tags most often associated with the conversations in this report. In the other sections of analytics here, you'll find much more detailed information on each category, but admin can use the overview report for a quick glimpse to check if the support team is operating as expected.